Hey everyone, I am back with another YouTube SEO video. I'm talking about how to make YouTube chapters on your videos and how it's gonna help out the SEO of those videos, help you appear in more organic search results. Let's go. Hey guys, my name is Jared Vandermeer and I make digital marketing tip and a lot of search engine optimization tip videos right here on YouTube. In this episode, I am going through how to make chapters on your videos. A new feature on YouTube, it used to be timestamps. Chapters are more prevalent now, so I want you guys to start using me in your videos. I'm trying to put them in all of mine and I'm gonna show you how to do it right now. So start up this screen record. I am going to go into one of my recent videos that's coming out in the next couple days, which is, does billboard advertising make sense? Explanation with math. Now I use this video for doing another video about YouTube tags using TubeBuddy to come up with the tags properly. I will put that in the cards above right now. Now doing the chapters, typically what I do in my videos now is I just, in my description, go to the point where I'm gonna say something like, here is some chapters to help you navigate this video. And then I just go right into it. Now, the mistake I see a lot of people make when they're putting in the timestamps into their descriptions is they miss one feature, and that is the 0, .00. And always with the 0, 0.00, I always just use something from the title of my video and something from the tags so that when it's merged together, kind of like regular SEO, when you have your page title and you made a description and the descriptions in your actual page, when they're cohesive and using the same words, it helps out. And I think it works the same with YouTube. I have created and corrected and it's made a massive difference as soon as I started doing this. So for this one, it would be does digital advertising makes sense. Now I've already gone through my video and watched it all to save you guys time and I'm just gonna copy and paste some here. So the first one, 0, 0.00, does billboard advertising make sense? And then I go through a whole bunch of other ones with all of the specific points of my video. One other key that I have here is with all of my chapters, I do relate these chapter titles as much as possible to the tags below. So for example, should you advertise on billboards? When I go down to my tags, I got here, should I advertise on a billboard? Very, very similar. I like to keep those cohesive again. I think it makes a big difference. And at the end of the day, when I look at TubeBuddy, right on the side here, it says add chapters. It's now a best practice. You got your add chapters. You got to get your subtitles and have your closed captions. You want to make sure you're doing all your tags and that your title is optimized. And when you factor all of those things in, all of those best practices help you peer higher in specific searches. I wanna give you guys one last example here in this episode. I think this is a pro tip, it's gonna help you guys. This is just an example of what's happened since I've started using chapters. So if I go to one of my other videos, saving that one ready to go out tomorrow, one of the recent videos I put out that's ranking well right now, the next big platform, if I click on it, I recently added chapters to this video. So I didn't launch it with chapters. And I've noticed right away that it started to get a lot more reach. And if I go down to my tags to see where I'm ranking based on TubeBuddy, I have, I'm ranking on almost all of my tags. And that was related to doing a lot of these chapters that relate to what my tags are below. So I think it's making a big difference. We've been creating and correcting. It's a best practice. It's something you should do on all your YouTube videos. I think it's gonna make a huge difference. I wanna keep this episode short and sweet. Don't wanna take any more of your time. I want you guys to go to your videos and start doing these chapters. Remember, 0, 0.00 starts it so that you don't wonder where your chapters are once you launch your videos. And I also talked about TubeBuddy a lot in this episode. Don't forget, I'm gonna put the links below of anything I always talk about in my videos. I'll put the TubeBuddy link below. It's helped me out a lot to understand more YouTube SEO. So it may help you guys as well if you wanna check it out. That's it for this episode, guys. I can't wait to see you guys in the next one. That's all for now.